Right. Oh, Bob's got some scream around right now. We got a shark. The Golden Crispies. What's going on, fishing fam? Got North Factory. A lot of mullet in the water today. We're gonna cast it, some mullet. We got some live shrimp and uh, we'll see what's gonna be chewing out there. See if there's any reds, any trout. Uh, blue water's coming in, see if any jacks wanna chew. See what's going on, guys. All right, y'all stay tuned. We'll hook up to something here, it feels like a poor red. Picked it up like one. Yeah, it's running like one too. My pops has a net over there. He's in the blue shirt. Oh, uh, the one with the... I got you, I got you, you're good. Careful, bro. Got him? Heck yeah. Okay. Oh, you got, you're good. Yeah, the line popped right there too. Oh, no shit. Yeah, you're good, it's in the, it's in the net. <laughs> nice. <laughs> you got it? It looks like an edible one though. Yeah, that's a good one. Oh, no, look at that, he's all torn up. Might be a putback. It's a 30 inch, right? 30 inch red guys. I'm gonna put him back in bro. I'm gonna put it back in. You got chewed up by a by a shark looks like. But you, you think you can hold the camera real quick for me? Yeah. There you go guys, 30 inch red. On a live finger moment. Like you were chewed up by a shark already. He deserves to live, guys. So he's going right back in. Chuck me over here. Oh, wow. He's got a red. Let me get my line here. Right, you're good right there, Dad. Let me get my line in. Fight him right there. Pop got a red, too. Oh yeah, dude. Alright, you're gonna have to work them over here now. If you're getting closer, come over here. Here? Yeah, right here. Oh, that's the smaller one. That's a trout. Oh. Came off. Oh, he came off the hook. That was a big trout. And it turned out that was a monster trout, guys. <laughs> Might have to go get some fresh ones right now, maybe. I don't think there's enough air down there for them. Dad. Damn. Oh, like that. Oh, okay. Right under the bottom half. Yeah, yeah. Right up, right about, yeah, right there.
Sorry guys, that was a monster truck. Thought it was a red. Came up and popped off. Came up right at the rocks and popped right off, guys. Yeah, something has it, I think. Got it. I think. Oh, I put it right out of his mouth, I think. Yeah, I think it was a trout too. Look at that, I thought you'd up. Had it brought you. Dang, man. I'm gonna see if I catch a couple of mullets real quick. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna just cast one more. Damn, they're dying already. Damn, I need some live ones. Here you go. Get that one. Going back out, guys. We got a big mullet, like I said, Carolina rig. I'm running the one ounce. My pops is using the two ounce. I'm just uh, bringing it in, putting it out with the current. Got yeah, something on. I'm just taking it. There's big trout. I just saw a big trout come up right now and go down. Oh, I dropped it. Whatever it was, dropped it. It feels like a red, unless it's a big trout. You're over my line. I, I gotta come this way anyway. Oh, it's a big trout. Woo! Both flipped them. Oh, that's a beauty. See how big she is. All right, guys, let's see how big this is. He is 22 and a half. That fish will definitely keep. It's the keeper. Okay. 22 and a half inch trout, guys, on a large finger mullet. Thank you. A lot of baits around the judges right now, guys. About, I want to say, four, four to five inch size mullet swimming around. There's red, sharks, big trout, everything. It's springtime, guys. They're out feeding. Oh, Pop's got some screamer on right now. We got a shark? I don't know. A bull red, maybe? <laughs> let me get my let me get my mullet up. <laughs> Excuse me, get the net. Man, he just took off screaming, huh, Pop? Yeah. Might be a bull red. It just stopped, right? It's staying still. I think this is it. Yeah, I think so too. Oh, uh, that's another guy has his line around yours right now. Got to walk these fish to the little area where we can net them at. The next wave. Try to bring them up. was it all right guys time to re-rig unfortunately we lost that red complications happened a wave came in and uh, we got a little excited pushed to an area where we were trying to land it and uh, the fish uh, just got swept away with the wave guys so uh, we're gonna see what's going on here and see if we get any more fish for now we're gonna rig up and get back out there all right guys we're back out Just like that guys, the bite stopped. Some brown water moved in. Still a ton of bait in the water. But uh, nothing but crabs for the past uh, few casts guys. It was a hot bite for a few seconds and it just turned off. Brown water came out of nowhere and that was it. We came out here with some finger mullet and some shrimp. It turned out that finger mullet was the key ton of finger mullet out here in the water right now but they're like five to six inches just made it back home 
and I decided to start uh, recording kind of late but uh, we're gonna go ahead and cook up this uh, 22 and a half inch trout I'll decide after I fillet them up how we're gonna cook them up but uh, so far so good especially how clean the meat is I haven't seen any worms in this it's always a good sign all right back inside got all the fillets so yes I have extra fish here this extra fish is actually some redfish I caught and uh, y'all are going to want to stay tuned for the next episode because that video is going to be awesome. Um, but here's some speckled chaw fillets along with some redfish and we're going to cook it in some beer batter with some beer. Alright guys, so we went simple and got the Louisiana beer batter. Louisiana mix is always good, but I couldn't go wrong with the beer batter mix on this time. It's going to be my first time using beer batter mix, I've never used it before. So on here it says to get a cup of your favorite beer or a beer or club soda. I'm gonna go with, uh, of course, my favorite beer. And we're gonna go with a cup of it. All right, time to stir it up. Here goes the beer into the mix. And we're gonna stir it up. Got my chef mom cooking it up right now. My mom's stirring up the, the beer batter mix. Like I said, it's going to be my first time trying out this beer batter mix. I've never tried out beer batter mix, but I'm sure it's going to be great. So I'm going to cut them in little pieces like this. Now we're going to chunk them in the bucket. Beer batter mix, that is. The beer batter mix bucket. Here we are. Nice little chunks. Go right in. piece of that trout and we'll continue here we go holy moly the sizzling is real folks well that trout's firing up I'm gonna go ahead and cut up a little bit more redfish. Like I said, next video after this, it's gonna be pretty awesome. You guys are gonna wanna stick around and check it out. All oh, that's redfish. The golden crispies. Got some fries in there also. I've never made beer batter fish before, but this beer batter looks amazing. Look at that beautiful beer battered fish with some fries, got some tartar sauce, ketchup, and some lemon. About to chow down. Now this is South Texas Fishing Fam. Make sure you hit that like, comment, and subscribe. We out.